what we have here behind us is a Michelin star restaurant. If you don't know what that is, tune in and find out. But I'm not here alone today. I'm here with the crew. Go ahead and introduce yourselves. It's your boy Angel Mother F and Lopez with my boy Edwin. You know, I'm gonna take over a little bit because his voice is not voicing right now. He's shocked, his yeah. voice is completely gone. Yeah, I'm excited bro, I can't wait to try this vibe. Let's get right into it, y'all, let's do it. Man, you have no voice today, but maybe La Movida can help that. I have taste buds. I know, but maybe La Movida can help that. You know what I'm so. saying? They can bring back your voice. Because, man, we got this Michelin star restaurant. If you guys don't know what that is, man, that means they're a top tier, one of the top restaurants, you feel me? You know, one of the best chefs, you know. In California, they're chosen as a Michelin star restaurant. So we're excited to go in here, you feel me? This place is actually Mexican. It's a Persian and Mexican place, you feel me? They got the Mexican style food, but with the Persian, you know, taste. Dude, look at this. This is absolutely stunning, gorgeous. This is like one of a kind, bro. Like, you don't see this anywhere, bro. Nate, you don't see this anywhere, huh? Nah, bro. I've, in Long Beach, bro, i never seen this before, bro. Look, we look fresh, bro. You want to know why? Mr. Mushies, you know what I mean? Shout out Mr. Mushies. Shout out Mr. Mushies. We look good today, you feel me? At this beautiful Mission to Star restaurant, man. The vibes are absolutely immaculate. It's almost like something I've never seen before for reals. Because I haven't. This is our Agua Chile. A little bit from right okay. down the street from the East Bay right there. That's where I live. We have our here is our uh, taquitos with a little bit of walnut adobo. I'm from LA, so like I say it a walnut like mole sauce in a way. With a little bit of love a little bit of uh, you know, beautiful uh, avocado and um, some pomegranates because we're Persian, right? You guys ordered one, one of them, but I was like, come on, guys, what the fuck? You gotta get all three of them, you know? So this is the saffron chicken right here. Okay. This is our jalapeno kubide, and this is our bag asada. It's a filet that we cut down, marinate with a little bit of uh, saffron, um, lemon, and salt. I don't know what just happened. I swear everything just happened so fast. I think Edwin is now talking. Nope, still didn't work. This is insane. They gave us a selection of everything to start off, man. They really hooked it up, man. Thank you to the chef, bro. Yeah, I'm overwhelmed. I don't even know where to start. I got the caviar fries, I got the taquitos, I got the tostada. I don't know, I don't know where to start. That's interesting, dude. Look, they like dissolve right into your mouth. Oh my god. Oh, and then we still got so much more to try. And you want to try? You want to try some, Chrissy? It's good. I like it a lot. It's a different flavor I've never tried before. So it's good. I like it. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Those are probably the best carrots I've ever ate in my life. Like, they're actually hella flavorful, bro. I haven't tried caviar yet, by the way. I want to try it. We got the caviar, man. I've never tried it in my life. You know, I've heard good things, bro. I've heard good things. Bro, what is caviar, bro? <laughs> I like, I really couldn't tell. Did you try the steak already? That was tasty. I just can't tell, like, if I tasted caviar or not. My name's Kevin Chance. I'm a culinary director for the company. Okay. Uh, I saw you guys from across the street. I was watching you all walk in. I just want to make sure you guys are having a good time. Enjoy Great. everything. We love uh, it right now. We love the vibe. Team and Bobby are the owners. They're fantastic. These are some of the nicest people I've ever worked with. This is what we do, and it's getting better and better every day, and we're pushing harder and harder every minute that we do what we do in this restaurant. But having you guys come in and appreciate what we do, I just want to come out and say thank you very, very much. Hey, that was genuine. Man, we so love that. Yeah. No, no, we no, no, appreciate yeah. you, thank so you so much. much. Yeah. Ooh. Try another one, try another one, try another one. I know you want another one. They said we go in the Mexican way, we don't need the forks around here. Why are you trying this Oh my god, that was beautiful, bro. I don't even know what to say about that. Like, Angel, bro, you have to try this steak. You already tried it? <laughs> There's nothing to be said, man. Oh my god. Mouthful, yeah. You could throw our reaction. This is amazing. This is absolutely five stars. Beautiful seasoning. This is actually something I honestly have not tried before. Like, this is truly something Michelin, bro. After seeing Brandon eat it, man, oh my god, I can't wait. So let's just dig in. I'm gonna get a big bite. I've had my spare share of video. This 
is for sure up there, dude. But the juice, oh my god, it's so tender. And the flavor of the juice of this video, oh my god, the caldo. Out of this goddamn world. It's so rich in flavor and it has like a little citrusy taste to it as well that I I love. I even put the lemon on it as well. But we got some cranberry. Wait, bro, what are you doing? <laughs> it's supposed to be like this. <laughs> the flavors explode in your mouth, you know what I'm saying? It takes a while for it to hit. It's the flavor just comes as it goes. That was insane. I don't have no words for that. I, I've never tried something like that. You try the skewer, I try the halibut. Here we go. Hold up though. They might have done something here. I don't like fish. It's tasty. It's tasty. It has a good lime fusion to it. A very good lime fusion to it. It's definitely the Mexicanest fish I've tried. Thank you to Movida. You guys absolutely killed it. This, there's a reason you're on this Michelin road to success. You know what I'm saying? You guys are successful, making it better every day, and completely competing with these top dogs, bro. This is beautifully made. I don't like seafood at all. I don't eat any fish. I don't eat nothing like that. I'm allergic to shrimp. I literally don't eat seafood, bro. I'm gonna try it, bro, because we're here, and it's for the experience, so. Come on, cheers. Like that wasn't actually as bad as I thought it was going to be. The, the texture is a little weird, don't get me wrong, but the flavor itself is not bad. How's your reaction, <laughs> Mr. Rutherford? It was all right. It was all right. <laughs> this food right here, magical, bro. Nah, you it's more magical than Disney, trust me. Nah, trust me. I got a dessert. I got a special dessert. It's not oh even on the menu, gosh, but just something for you. Really? Oh my yeah, god, bro. Yeah. So when you see it, yeah, when you see it, I'm like, okay. <laughs> Movida. You guys are a movement, bro. You guys are doing a move, bro. We're getting something that's not even on a menu. This guy is platinum. He's an amazing chef. He's a chef of our restaurant. He is the heart and soul of what we do here. And so we're executing the chef's vision. Something that's not even on the menu. Just something to have some fun with. But uh, but it's all of our favorite thoughts, right? It's pistachio. It's pistachio crumble. It's chocolate. It's caramel. It's uh, a saffron pastry cream. It's everything that we're about from Persian and, to Latin and fusion. And a dope ass dove on top of it. Right? Yeah, that's what I was looking at. I was like, dude, that's right. definitely a dove, bro. That's <laughs> insane. Don't, do not pull pigeons off the street and try to recreate No, this. absolutely yeah. not. No. But, um, shit, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> he spoke. He's not sick no more. <laughs> I'm flying with the dub right now, bro. That's crazy. Delightful. That was delectable. Scrumptious. Absolutely one of a kind. Oh my god, I cannot. Marvelous. It's probably one of the most best tasting and luxurious desserts I've ever had. That's for y'all back at LB. For the one time. Flying with the bird. I didn't try this ice cream. I'm gonna take your fork. I don't even know what to do, bro. Start flying. Well, shout out to Movida for showing us the amazing gratitude, you know? Boy, that shit was a 10 out of motherfucking 10, bro. That shit was fire. The environment was fire and everybody there was what about fire. The, what about the customer service? Oh, it's 100 out of 10. Like, oh my God, it's just they outdid themselves. I give it a 10 out of 10. Really good. This was, shit was fucking fire. That shit was fire. Like, that, that was, I think, a 10 out of 10 and definitely deserves not one, but two. Michelin stars. That was the best experience food review Food video I have ever done on this channel. You guys made art you for me And that's one thing a lot of people can't do so, you know, that was beautiful beautiful art pieces that you brought to us It just it just left these speechless didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, it's just I've been no pun time. intended. He literally cannot speak. Yeah, he literally can't speak. It's crazy. Ain't much else to say from America and the whole entire world your boy Nate, Angel, Edwin Movida. From Adelaide to the Bay. And Krusty Vlogs. Ah.